Hi everyone, welcome to another video in our series on managing and maintaining your Kyocera Task Alpha MFPs. In today's video, we're going to be discussing how to scan to a folder via the SMB protocol from the touch screen interface of your copier. This can be useful if you are scanning uh, to another coworker's folder and they're not in the address book. It is also extremely helpful when setting up a permanent folder destination for the first time. Now, this is a fairly advanced process, so we're going to be needing a couple things. The first thing that we'll need is we'll need the folder that we wish to scan to to be shared. If you're unsure how to do this, please watch our video on how to share a folder for SMB scanning. You're also going to need the IP address uh, of you, the computer that the folder sits on, as well as a username and password that can access, uh, i.e. read and write, to that folder. So without further ado, let's get started. The first thing we'll do is we'll hit the send button. And then from here, we'll get to the destination screen. And then we'll go to the folder path entry button on the right hand side. The easiest way to do this is to search for the folder by the host name. So we'll hit next here. Now, if you're part of a domain or a work group, you can enter that here. You don't have to. What you'll do next is you'll click the host name button. You'll enter the IP address of the computer you're trying to scan to. Once you're done with that, select OK. You'll hit OK, and at that point, the computer, uh, sorry, the copier will attempt to locate that computer on the network. Once it has done so, it'll ask you for a login, username, and password. This is the same username and password that you use uh, to access the folder. Um, it can also be the login password that you use when you access the computer. Once you have entered, your password, um, select OK at the bottom here. And then hit OK at the bottom to log in. Once you have logged in successfully, it will display a list of all shared folders located at the root of the C drive on your computer. In this particular instance, we're going to be scanning to our scans folder here. So once this is highlighted, I will select OK. And what you will see here is that our information is now input in the different fields. From here, I can either do a connection test to confirm that my connection is OK. I can either add it to the address book if I want to add a permanent scanning destination. Or if I'm just doing a one-off scan, I can select OK. And then from here, you'll see that my folder is now on the destination screen. And I can hit the green Start button to scan the folder, uh, to scan to the folder. And voila, no errors, so that means that our document has arrived in its intended folder. Once again, my name is Sam Hammond, Lead Product Trainer here at Boston Document Systems. In today's video, we discussed how to create an SMB folder destination from the touch screen panel of your Kyocera Task Alpha MFP. I want to thank you for joining me today, and I look forward to seeing you all again. Thank you. Mm -hmm.